Alright everybody, we're back with Kathy Rain. Last we left off, I was scratching my head and about to cry over this puzzle here. Maybe not cry exactly, but the puzzle, that one, that middle part of that puzzle was no fun. Alright, so we just figured out what the combination is to the safe. I hope she wrote it down because I don't remember what it is. We're going back to the church. To open that safe. To the church. Alright. We're close. We're so close. Alright, let's they're gonna make me push the buttons, aren't I aren't they? Alright, let's see if I wrote Oh I did. Let's look at this. So six one 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 two two. Okay. Get me out of here. There it is. Let's look at the save. Let's open the save. Six one 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 two two. Yeah. Yes. Mean business. Found a bunch of torn out Bible pages and a tape in there. Oh, a tape. I thought she said tape. All right. Micro cassette from the wall safe. Remove tape. Operation log. Oops. Let's combine the micro cassette with this. Let's examine this. This is William T. Price. My visions concerning my sons are troubling. I've watched them become corrupted with pride, turning their backs on our prophet, the Crimson One. The Crimson I've seen One. The history of the church wiped clean, replaced with trickery and lies. This message is part of a fail safe. Should these predictions come to pass, I've hidden it so that only the true agents of the old God, selected by the Crimson One, may find it. Now, hear these words. You must stare into the abyss and let the abyss stare back into you. It's the only way to cleanse yourself of sin and achieve true salvation. May God be with you. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I should present this this new stuffs to Reverend Price, Father Price. Currently cooped up in jail while she's walking to the door. Oh, I'm just gonna take a look at my inventory. So let's head back to the to the sheriff station. And hit good old Father Price with this, hopefully. Talk to Isaac. I have more things to say to you. Speak what you will, godless one. I have stared into the abyss. Oh. Why did you destroy Lily's paintings? Is that what you think I did? They looked pretty ruined to me. Mm. Like an ignorant child, you look only to the surface and not on what lies hidden beneath. Are you implying that the paintings contain some hidden message? Oh yes. Lily was special in God's eyes. A chronicler. A bestower of wisdom. As an emissary of God, it is my duty to unlock the divine knowledge in her work for all of mankind. Alright, well that's that. Oh, I didn't get a chance to look at the Bible pages. Look what I found in the church, Isaac. Come to gloat, have you? I see that you've added stealing to your list of sins. Honestly, I just want to understand. What does it all mean? The mending? I don't believe you're sincere for a second. I will speak of this no longer. So there's probably no point. Listen to this, Isaac. Oh, I guess there is a point. This is William T. Price. My what is this? My sons are troubling. I've watched them become corrupted with pride, turning their backs on our prophet, the Crimson One. I've seen the history of the church wiped clean, the replaced red man. with trickery and lies. This message is part of a fail safe. 
The red man is the prophet. I don't believe it. The I crimson saw all one. This coming. God, have I strayed from the faith? It's not too late to redeem yourself, Isaac. I've met the crimson one. We are on the same side. Preposterous. No one has witnessed that apostate since father's death. I've been north of the lake, but he's nowhere to be found. He abandoned us all, and the divine work now rests upon my shoulders. You believe that you are carrying out the work of the Crimson One? Don't think I can't hear that mocking tone of yours. I will speak of this no longer. He mentioned north, north of, of the, the lake. lake. That's part of Conwell Woods. Is this I'll a probably new have to narrow location? it down more, but it's something. No, what do you mean you have to narrow it? Oh, new location, okay. Gross. Progress. Ooh, progress feels Father. good. Have you abandoned me? I will atone for my sins. I swear it. Uh-oh. God have mercy on me. Uh-oh. Uh, let's just go back in and check real quick. This area in here. Okay, he's still there. Still looking okay. Normally when people speak of atonement, it results in the death of somebody. I just want to read these. The mending is the sacred unity with God and the only way to reach true salvation. The Crimson One finds lost souls on behalf of God. Unshackled by time, he guides them and bestows wisdom upon them. He grants them dreams and visions, preparing them for the mending. The living menders must then descend upon the stairs of judgment. Each step reflects a piece of their soul. When they must, Then they must face their shadow self, a servant of God who will pose them at every turn. Lastly, the mender shall perform the three holy sacraments. The sacred unity with God and the only way to reach true unity with God. It's interesting that the shadow self is the servant of God and it opposes them. Okay. Tonight with God, three holy sacraments must be performed the atonement of the mother the absolution of the father and the contrite the contrition for the son god shall then gaze upon the mender weighing their hearts the worthy shall be cleansed of sin and be allowed to reach sacred unity facebook i have no idea what that means the damned shall have their heart consumed and be cast into the abyss J C L M and J R, where they shall be cleansed of sin. Father, nope, that's not right. Um, so this I assume is for Joseph Rain. This is probably Lily Myers, J C. Um, Joseph Cochran, Jesse Cochran. I don't remember what his first name is, but it began with a J. So, the presumption for whoever wrote this stuff in here it might be me. Or Kathy. It says that the damned, that they are damned and they had their heart consumed and they were cast into the abyss. God shall then gaze. Oh, okay. So this is like a, like a trial to be performed to gain God's like favor i guess you're cleansed of all sin fb fb i'm not sure who this is i'm not sure who fb is the crimson one wait let's go now that my book has changed let's ask father price about the I have more one. things to say to you. Speak what you will, godless one. I already talked to him about that. All right. Oh, not that one. Sorry. What is your church really about, Isaac? What are you trying to accomplish? The same as any yeah. other church. All we want is the salvation of mankind. By any means necessary? Clearly, kidnapping isn't out of the question. I feel like we've had this conversation before. Evil. I look at the bigger picture, the greater good. One day you'll understand. You are quite obviously brainwashed. I'll stop you, if it's the last thing I do. You can try, child. I have God on my side. I'm done here. Good. 
Now go repent, sinner. I don't know anybody whose first name begins with an F. Well, we've got a new location. Let's go check that out. Uh, there it is. Conwell Woods. These locations are starting to take over the screen here. There's nothing here. Bushes, sticks, north, <gasps> Ooh. west, east, south. I'm pretty sure he said that it was north. I seem to have developed some hiccups. Oh, this is gonna be like a maze, isn't it? It's gonna be like a left, left, north type situation. Left, left, north. <laughs> left, left, up, down, right, left. That's north, that's south, that's east. Okay, good. What the? How did I get back here? I must be going in circles. <laughs> My concern was that I wouldn't be able to get back here. Alright, so I need to figure out where I'm supposed to go. As far as I know, I don't have that information. Somehow I feel like if anybody were to have this information, it would be Nathan. And the cabin is still available, so let's head there. Oof. Cabin on the lake by the woods. It's like you're asking for it. Oh, everybody's still gone. Well, that works. Let's just take a look at this drawing one more time. Red man, Lily, me. A bald man dressed in red. Oh, creepy. The crimson one. Supposedly a prophet to this old god. Nathan is drowning Lily in the lake. That's creepy. I don't have any anything additional. I have these Bible pages. He says he said he couldn't find them. He doesn't have any information for me. Conwell Lake, where Lily Myers met her demise. Where did Nathan go? <laughs> I can't go to the clearing anymore. Let's head to Grandma's. Grandma's house is the hub. I do my best thinking there. And they're the only places available to me. Our Grandma's, the Sheriff's Station, the cabin, and Cornwall Woods. I'm so glad that these places that have no relevance are blocked out. I'm so glad that they took that option from me. Red horse for a red man? Hmm. There's a painting here too. I should melt this one. Oh, that's right. We found some custody papers found in the storage unit. Uh, might as well. I got nothing better going Hi, on. Grandma. Listen. I found something in this storage unit. Oh? What was it? Papers, Grandma! Custody papers. With my name on them. I was hoping you wouldn't have to see those. I need I'm to know what happened, Grandma. I'm an adult now. You <sighs> can tell me. Sharon was never a good mother to you, Kathy. I know. It was the illness. She tried her best. It wasn't all bad. You don't know the despicable things she and Brian did. Drugs. Violence. We wanted something better for you. Joseph started talking to lawyers, staying up late at night on the phone, trying to find a way, some kind of loophole to get you back. But eventually we ran out of courts to appeal to, and your mother retaliated with a restraining order. Interesting. And that was it. 
She had won. I wish things could have been different. I do too, dear. Every day. Now you're getting me close to tears. Let's talk about something else. Okay, Grandma. Do I have anything else to talk about? Yeah. There are a few things I need to ask you, Grandma. Very well, dear. Uh, I feel like we're a bit over Grandma's head on this one. Have you heard about someone or something called the Crimson One? Goodness, dear. You're giving me the chills. I distinctly recall your grandfather mumbling that word in his sleep. Crimson. Crimson. He did? After he had the injury? Yes, he rarely spoke at all, but that's the single word I can clearly remember. Strange. Grandma's the Crimson One. I found these in the church. Do they mean anything to you, Grandma? I'm not sure, dear. Is there anything in particular you'd like to ask me about them? Maybe. I'll let you know if I think of anything. Ugh. I don't really have much else to show her. I'm done. I guess. Okay, that's all I need. Good luck out there. So... Grandfather was on to something about the Crimson Man. This paint looks fresh. Grandma must have had this restored recently. Can I pour paint thinner on it? <laughs> no, I can't even get at it. Why? Why would this... Oh. Okay, so in that bout of not cheating I just did, um, I... <laughs> miraculously figured out what to do next and the reason it's miraculous is because it makes absolutely no sense with or without context this makes no sense come on give me my pointer give it to me I'll just borrow this for a while yeah I'm not sure why you'd borrow it now and not the five other times I clicked on it and tried to take it, because now she feels like she needs it, even though the reason she needs it makes absolutely no sense. Let's go. It's redonkulous. I don't understand where in there it indicated that you would need something temperature related to determine which way to go. I guess we're going this way. In the direction of colder, maybe? The, the thermometer changed, so I presume that that is the correct direction. I, again, I don't understand why the thermometer makes a difference. This is stupid, in my opinion. So, I guess we're making our way, okay, we're going north, we're making our way there. We haven't looped back to the motorcycle, so this is working. It's not that way. Oh, we're going east. Met her end. My god, what is this place? Found the abyss. Looks like an abyss to me. Sea of Flowers message. Met her end. Someone left this message here for me. For you? Specifically? Why would you think that? Let's look at the it's sea. It's the of red flowers. scythe flower. Must be hundreds of them here. Oh, this is the red scythe flower? Smell sea of flowers. So much for being endangered. Yeah, I don't think this these flowers cause hallucinations. A huge I, hole with no visible bottom. Why would I want to smell them? You can see something right here. Look, it's a question What's marks. That? I can see something. Faintly. Quick, throw your lighter at it. <laughs> That's never the solution, but maybe one day. I don't want to burn. Yeah, alright, let's smell the sea of flowers and see what happens. 
See how we trip. Intense. Oh, they're making me a bit dizzy. Let's... Oh. Oh, it's supposed to be an escalator, I guess. Greetings. It's the you Crimson again. One. Me again. You better have some answers, Crimson One. Yeah. All in due time. Your friend is being claimed by the darkness. She's standing on the brink of the abyss as we speak. Are you talking about Eileen? Mm -hmm. Yes. If you wish to save her, you must descend. Why? What is down there? The tribulation. The reflection of the soul. We call it the mending. mending. Who's we? Oh. My kind. Servants of the old god. To what end do you serve this god? What does your kind actually want? Yeah. All we want is for you to take your medicine, Kathy. For you to grow and be happy. If that's the case, why were all those people hurt? Lily? Jimmy? Grandpa? You misunderstand. What one wants and what one is able to do are two different things. All right, Happiness point there. is not a one-way street. It cannot be given. Only earned. Your grandfather understood that. He embraced it. Wait, you saw Grandpa? Oh yes, right here. He was a tortured soul, desperate for some kind of meaning after losing the light of his life. You. Oh. He sought the power below, the vessel of redemption. But Grandpa didn't make it. He failed. How could I succeed when he wasn't able to? He was so much stronger than me, so much braver. Is that what you believe? Perhaps you don't know him as well as you think. But why me? Why are you making me do this? Yeah, because why me? Because you so desperately need it, Kathy. You're haunted by your past, by all these painful memories long forgotten. They follow you like a shadow, pulling you down. They taint your every thought, impulse, and deep desire. Hmm. It is foul to us. <laughs> this is crazy. I could just walk away, get on my bike and drive, forget I was ever here. There's nothing stopping you. We both know we're not doing Eileen. that. Yeah. We're going down. I can't leave her like that. Down, 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 da -dooby, down, da -dooby, down. I see now down, why he speaks down. so highly of you. The old god, I assume. Oh boy. Down the rabbit hole, September 29th, day five. Surreal. It looks like grandma's, but different. Kuroge? Hey. Where'd all my things go? My pockets are empty. What? My inventory! <laughs> they stole it from me! Gears are moving behind the window. Am I inside some huge, bizarre machine? An old elevator. I don't see any way to open it. Not yet, anyway. Let's look at the lamp. A small desk lamp. I can see something inside. Let's check the lamp. There was a pen hidden inside. A pen. Oh, my inventory. Feels better now. The paintings resemble TV static. Guess the reception down here isn't too good. That's creepy. Static is creepy in any any capacity. I don't care what anybody says. Alright, let's look at the book. Joseph Rain, Eileen Summers, Catherine Rain. Please sign in. 1981, 1995, 1995. Yeah, she was here yesterday. <laughs> See, the dates are formatted day, month, year. I don't know. Let's sign in, I guess. It's funny to me that Eileen's just like, yeah, let's do it. Catherine Rain. What the? Oh, it's the shadow me. You're Same and yet to be here. Slightly more powerful. Who are you? you look just like me. 
I should ask you the same thing, imposter. Do you like what we did to Mom? Don't you just want to kill her sometimes? I know I do. What are you talking about, Mom? She's here. You're a complete lunatic, aren't you? You're a complete lunatic, aren't you? Takes one to know one. Uh -oh. Now, I'd love to stay and chat, doppelganger, but I have more important things to do. Ta-ta. Bye. Good riddance. Hey, hey, I didn't look at the phone. So I just want to check that out first. No dial tone. And the chain door. <laughs> I missed that as the well. The door is sealed by two thick chains attached with padlocks. No getting in there. All right. Up the elevator. Let's look at it. The elevator is open. Let's go. I guess we're going... Are we going up or down? Two. We're on one? Oh, okay. We're on one. <laughs> so the next one would be two, I guess. Logistically. Are these supposed to be, like, body outlines? Oh, this is the bar. The, that the black cat bar. That alive. Ooh, is it alive? Ooh, it looks More disturbing. More gears grinding away. Something about them makes me uneasy. I don't even want to think about what happened there. Is this blood? There's stuff everywhere. No comments on these, like, little squiggles on the floor, huh? There's n we're not actually stepping inside to this room, so I guess we're going to head back into the elevator and go up to three. To do lack of options. Oh, this is the cabin. More gears grinding away. Some- Yep. Nothing in this place appears to be tuned. Huh. <laughs> What an astute observation. Crank. Broken link. Casket. Ooh, the static got louder when she walked past it. The chain looks broken there. Looks like the crank is connected to a mechanism for raising the cage. No use. The chain is broken. I'll need to fix it first. A small casket is placed in the middle of the cage. Who's in the casket, I wonder? Alright, so there's nothing else to do here. All I still have is a pen. I'm not sure... It's fairly sharp. Might have some other uses apart from writing. It's an old-fashioned pen. Plenty of ink inside. Uh, let's see, it's sharp. I wonder if I can use the pen on the padlock down at the bottom floor. I wonder. Let's try the first floor again. I presume there's no leaving. There's no, like, exit notification. Can I use it here? I don't see how those things work together. You had to walk all the way over there to determine that they didn't work together? So, what do we have? What are we working with? We got a window, we got a chain door, a lamp, a book, a small desk lamp. That combination makes no sense. I hear ya. So are we- Grandpa's name, my name, and Eileen's name are listed here. August 81, yesterday, and today. The dates all match. Looks like Grandpa and Eileen have both signed already. Are we the only three that have ever been in this abyss? We're the only three that have signed in. She doesn't actually go into the room on the second floor. Static, lamp, phone, book, static. Just wildly swinging my, my mouse around. Trying to find stuff. All right, let's let's ride the elevator again. Let's check the second floor again. Number two. 
Oh, I thought this was moving for a moment. That thing looks alive. Is it, though? Oh, it can move her in. Duh. Oh, look at that! There's more room over here! Oh. 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 Who's oh this? Oh my god. Mom? Mom? You're here? Mom? It's Mom! She's being held up against the wall by something sticky. I have to get her loose, somehow. Was she always here? Is this the cause of her illness? Hmm. Interesting. That's a interesting Mom, theory. Can you hear me? <laughs> Don't worry, I'll find a way to get you out of here. She's in no condition to speak. I can't actually interact with anything. So we're gonna exit. Oh, wait! There's some blood on this wall. Let's rip it. It's too tough. I might need something sharp to get it open. Let's use the sharp pen that we noted was sharp earlier. <coughs> there was a scalpel hidden inside the wall. Oh, we just got something even got sharper. It. Let's A razor look at it. sharp surgical scalpel. Oh, I should be able to cut her down with this, no? Either a useful tool or a deadly weapon. Or both. Let's not cut her. There we go. There we go. What's behind there her? There you go, Mom. Are you okay? There's something behind her. <laughs> no! <laughs> I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? I had no choice. I had to put you away. Mom, no, what have I done? I had no choice. I had to put you away. You started hurting yourself. You started hurting me. That's right. You gotta do the right you. thing. <laughs> That's alright, Kathy. Oh, God. Get me out of this place. Nope, we're doing okay. There's a refrigerator. <laughs> the refrigerator hopes in jar and inkier heart rule me nemesis. Refrigerator magnets in the shape of scrabble tiles. The score values are off though. I remember because the game I played with E the other day. Hopes in jar and inkier heart rule me nemesis. Not sure what to make of it all. Hopes in jar and inkier heart rule me nemesis. I feel like they should be scrambled. I'm not sure... Into what? But... Alright, can we open the fridge? Let's open the fridge. There's What's a weird there? scarab thing in there. Scarab? Got it. What is it? Oh, that's what I thought. Oh, it's a heart scarab. It's the red scarab I found in the refrigerator. When I shake it, I can hear something moving inside. Stab it. It has a hard shell. I'll need something heavy to break it. Stab it. That combination makes no sense. Something heavy, huh? An inkier heart. I don't even remember what the other two were. Dead I don't body. Even look. It's okay. It's all right. Exit. Gosh darn it all. <laughs> There's a thing on the floor. Was this always here? Postcard. Looks like a postcard is lying here on the floor. I don't think this was always here. Hi, baby girl. Living the life over here in Mexico. I have a new family now and I've forgotten all about you. I don't regret leaving you for a second since your mom was a whore and I never loved you anyway. All the best, Dad. Thanks, Dad. Love you too. Oh. Hey there. You killed Mom. That wasn't Mom. It was some kind of monster. We're all monsters to you, aren't we? Kill her, Dad. 
No. Dad. It can't be. Who's your daddy now, bitch? Can we escape the situation? Stay. Yes. It's locked. Run. I can't. Run. I'm trying. There we go. I don't know what her last line of dialogue was. I've been angry was. with you for as long Ooh. as I can remember. I've hated you more than words can say. I will never forgive you, Dad. But I'm done being angry. I'm done with letting you have an impact on my life. Yeah. I'm over it. Hello, daughter. I should have done this a long time ago. There are so many things I wish I could say to you. You have two brothers and a sister here. They always ask about you, their big sister in the USA. Leaving you was the biggest mistake I ever made. Please forgive me, Dad. Aw. I'm good too, Dad. I'm good too. So a lot has, has gone down in this a bar jukebox. here. Broken by the looks of it. Nothing is lit up. I know this is a horrible spot to stop, but I'm gonna stop here because the video's already gone on long enough. Uh, I'm picking it right back up again in the next episode, so if you want to see what happens, I know I do. Stick around. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.